Yes, I wanted to be a, a member of parliament. I once told my grandmother that. I mm -hmm. keep on saying that. And she told me I cannot be a member of parliament. Not because of hatred, but because uh, she could see the challenge that they had when I got born with albinism and the kind of challenges they went through as a family. Mm -hmm. And it was inconceivable then. That to imagine that you'd ever become a member of parliament? Yes. Okay. But deep within, I knew I would. I mean, and, uh, and, and, and did that discourage you when she felt or thought that that's not a possibility? I think it uh, didn't hit me because it was an innocent comment. Mm -hmm. uh, well, it, it put a question on, on, on whether that was possible, but it never deterred my, uh, my, my spirit. I, mm -hmm. I knew that uh, I would pursue it uh, either way. Okay. And I'm very glad that it actually happened that I was the first person with albinism to be a member of parliament in this country. All right.